Alrighty, hi, you Leute, and welcome back to another episode of Metroid Prime Hunters, where today, hopefully, we're going to be snagging up some Octoliths. Hopefully. Now, you know, you may have noticed that there was, in fact, no upload yesterday. Um, shit, teleporter, huh? Simply put, I have no idea what to replace, um, Transistor with. Like, genuinely no clue. I mean, I could have just uploaded another episode of Metroid, but... Eh, I don't know. I was sitting there until, like, genuinely... Basically, up until the episode was supposed to come out. Hang on, we've got to go in here. And I was like, what do I play? 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 And... yeah. I th think, I th I believe it'll be a Starbound multiplayer series, oopsie daisy. That's kind of the most likely thing to happen right now. So, if you're interested in that, um, I mean, <laughs> I mean wait till next Saturday, I guess. <laughs> But yeah, there's still some things I would have to work out, and who knows. It might... I don't know, dude. Anyway, we've opened the next portal for uh, last time we were on. So now we get the joy of immediately starting the episode with the juicy boss fight. In this case, we have another Spire coming at us. Cretafit V2. This modified version of the Cretafit cybernetic defense mechanism features bursts of heat-seeking plasma. There's green globs there. A key component of Olympic military defense technology, it was designed to safeguard the Olympic's most sacred objects. They're... They're glowing knocks. They're... They refuse to keep safe with anything more than this pillar or the eye. Yeah, like, is, it, is that all it does, though? Not gonna lie to you, Chief. I was kind of expecting the the green globs to be in addition to other defenses. Boss is annoying, though, huh? I'd much prefer the eye, to be honest. <laughs> Just constantly have to mass around. That's really freaking annoying. It's not even scary, it's just kind of annoying. Look at this. Look at this, dude! What the hell? Ow. See, at least he did deal damage. I wasn't exactly paying attention to my health bar there. What a boss fight, huh, boys? Incredible. Come on. Yeah, I think from the corner of my eye that dealt some okay damage. Really? No! Oh, we're alternating blue and red now. Fantastic. Level up, huh? <sighs> Gee willikers. What a, what a boss, huh? What an experience. Aren't you glad you, you tuned in today? Holy shit, man. <laughs> Can I just use like this? No, I can't. How about this? Oh, 
I mean, yeah, I could use it, but... I don't see it being too much better than the power beam, to be honest. That should be game, yeah. What a boring boss, what the hell? <laughs> Like, at least the ones that shot lasers, you had to pay some amount of attention to. This guy was just... Whoo, buddy! There we go. Lost. We are all. Yoda, you are all. Boop, boop, boop. Open up this door. And then get ready for the incredible escape sequence of like two doors again. Security protocol activated. Whee! Guardians? What do you know? Yeah, I'm just gonna come over there. <laughs> oh my god, what was that? Go, that takes care of that. There's probably going to be a guardian in the other room as well, otherwise this would just be ridiculously easy. I mean, so was the last one on this planet, to be fair. Boop. And there we go, we're out, basically. Because they can't spawn guardians around the ship. Yeet. GG no re. Well, that was both in this place then, so let's head somewhere else. So I believe we're missing ones on Alanos and Arctera at this point. So let's go. Oh, I don't want to go back to Alanos. Let's do that last actually because that's also where the final portal is. So we need to go there anyway. As in, like, the place where you, where you actually use the crystals. Alright! That was the wrong portal. Oh no, we didn't activate the second one yet, did we? Okay, never mind, so we will actually have to take this one. And then trek our way back. Run. Do 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 do. Alright, so we were going over here and then through the maze, and then we had no idea where to go from there. So that was fun. Okay, see, so remember? Which you probably do. Because, uh. Because, <clears throat> uh, why wouldn't you? We've been in this maze like four times in the series already. This has, like, the crystal post things in front of it. Why? This was just an empty room, right? Unless I already got something in here at some point? I don't freaking remember. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, this is just an empty room. Uh, 
then there was the locked area up here, which I have no idea how to open. Not this. Die. Here, this place. No way, dude. It's not locked. You just have to jump a little fucking ledge. Oh no. Well, boys, thanks for locking the door behind me, by the way. Well, boys, I found the way forward. God, you son of a bitch. That was it? Got him. <laughs> okay, so we need to open this force field to hit that switch. Spectral lock three deactivated, so I take it there are two more. Also, I get to show off my terrible reading again. Olympic War 06. Gorea is a cancerous bloom that would wreak havoc across the universe. Gorea 04. Gorea mimicked our cellular structure and replicated itself in solid form. <laughs> spectral locks. Adjusting the optical spectrum may reveal the truth. Oh, really? Invisible crap. Spectral lock one. There's an artifact, obviously, which is exactly what we're here for, by the way. In case you haven't noticed. Spectral lock two. Eh? Bam, get no scoped. There we are, now we just need to get up there. But I also need to check out the rest of this room. Hang on, let's see if there's any data shades here that I'm missing. Yes, there are. Olympic War 12. We gave our lives to confine the foul monstrosity known as Gorea. Do not seek this creature unless you have the means to destroy it! Yeah, come on, we're Sam Aaron. We have the means to destroy anything. Including planets, if we feel like it. Olympic War 01. The war lasted three standard galactic months. Even with the galaxy's most powerful technology at our disposal, we fell like dry grass beneath the blade. And so UA expansion. Oh, come on. <laughs> Let me up. 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 Yep. And enemies. I mean, shit or not. That works too. I don't really care. Oof. Artifact discovered. Where was the third portal then? I mean, oh, there, there are the enemies. Thank you. Off. Uh, these guys are so annoying. Actually, no, these, these guys wouldn't be annoying at all if the control scheme wasn't so ass. But, you know, DS game being a DS game right there. Oh, I missed. Unfortunate! <laughs> Wasn't there a door upstairs as well that led somewhere? Hang on. I feel like there was, wasn't there? Yeah, that's just literally this door though. Now what? We still have one force field and a teleporter to worry about. That's that way, that's that way, that's that way. I still can't find my way around here, apparently. Despite all the times we've been in here. Switch. 
check on this place, see if there's anything new here. Not so far, no. We've got this this one, we've got one there, so our next fragment has to be back there somewhere. Question being, how the hell do we get back there? It's a big got force field in the way. Oh my god. You're kidding. I mean, yeah, or, or you could just stand up here like a normal... Where was the... It was the R button. There it is. You're kidding. You just stand up here and shoot over the force field? That is so dumb. What the hell? Ah, uh, well. We're finding all kinds of stupid solutions today. Chip deck portal activated, thank you, but we're only like 17 minutes in actually, that's, that's not that bad. You know what? Screw it. Screw it. Let's do Arctera today as well. Alright, here we are. I remember this room, actually. I thought it was on Islanders, though. Not here. Oh, you can't even move. That was the wrong gun. That was the wrong gun. Ow. Oh, now you can move? Now you can bloody move? What? <laughs> Ow. Ow. Thank you for that, very helpful. Oh, pfft. <laughs> uh, I mean, that was obviously all on purpose, right? Right? You walk along the side here. Yeah, okay, let's just do it like that then. Bruh. <laughs> <clears throat> you know, just uh, don't mind me, just uh, item hunting, as usual. You know how it is. <clears throat> what the hell? I was not expecting that to be there at all. No! Kidding. <laughs> no! Stop! I don't. You can't get up this way, can you? Oh no. This looks the exact same as the other plate. Wait. Wait a minute. Which way are we now? Aha! We're the correct way around, apparently. Good! Good! Took me a while to realize what the hell I'm looking at there. Can I stand on it? Wow. Wow, it's got verticality as well. Shit. Where actually was that thing though? Oh, up there. Right, that's what I'm looking for in the first place, then. Yeah, no, I figured I couldn't hit it from here. Or can I? No, I don't think I can. Um, here's somewhere, then. Apparently not. Why not? Okay. I was gonna say I felt like I had a pretty clear shot. So are they all open or what was that? Why did it just fold open as I looked at it? What the heck? 
Uh, 21. Yeah, we'll be fine. Sure. Uh, which way was to the portal again? I accidentally found it the first time around, and now I can't find it. Okay. No, I mean, not portal. Uh, the elevator here. I was gonna say platform, but then it started moving. Ew. Ew, 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 what is this? Ew! Ugh. Thank you for not doing that anymore. Lift control. Activating lift. I mean, I mean, I'm pretty sure the lift was active already if I came down via the lift. Olympic War 04. Korea devoured our people's lives and life energy and grew powerful from it. Death swept across our worlds and we despaired. Good. Enlarged forebrain looking asses. Scan this. Yes, but there's nothing, nothing of note there. Fantastic. Olympic War 11. To contain Gurria, our people reduced themselves to pure telepathic energy through the process of essence transference. Mm, yes, quite. Hello, turret. I hear you. Olympic War 05. We feared not only the extinction of our race, but the possibility that the evil would sweep the galaxy, annihilating all in its path. Wrecked. Ah, thank you! Not sure why a random turret would trigger that, but thank you very much, good sir. And there is number three. Portal activated. Access the inaccessible. Let's go! Uh, I don't suppose we can get out from back here, right? No. I don't think so. It looks like we're gonna have to take the long way around. Quite unfortunate, to be honest. Because this is right on the other side of those ice, ice block walls. There we go. Yeah, so we're gonna have to walk the long way around, so I'll see you back at the portal. Thanks. Ah, never mind. What the hell is this then? What the fuck? Are they just throwing more guardians, more and more guardians at me? What the hell? Quit it! There we go! Double kill! Oh my god, is there more? Leave me alone! What the hell? <laughs> that was utterly random. Alrighty, well here we are. Let us just ignore all of these fools. Get some of our health energy back, and then access the inaccessible for the second time today. I didn't miss anything again, did I? No, this just always says the same thing. Nice, nice, nice. Please be an eye instead of a tower, but I feel like we've already fought like all of the eyes, though. I feel like all of the bosses left now are going to be towers. Oh, what do you fucking know? It's a tower. <laughs> What was that little twist there? What the? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> v4! The apex of the Kretofid line of cybernetic defenses. This ultimate model deploys lethal lasers and homing plasma weaponry from a mobile tower whose very casing is an offensive weapon. A key component of Olympic military defense technology was designed to succeed where all others fail. Good! Yeah, I was just thinking that. Now this is, is more like it. Ow.
There we go, that works wonders against it, doesn't it? Woo. I would actually like to have that health there. And it just despawned as I said that. Fantastic, thank you. Ah, screw off. <laughs> I'm not quite sure how they made what is essentially a stone pillar move around in the room like this, but it's quite entertaining. Look at the damage that's dealing, huh? Compared to the garbage I was using on the other one? Mmm! Go, now it's just you, I think. Get fucked. <laughs> that was actually way quicker than the easier one. <laughs> nice. Alrighty, boys. End was upon us all! You know, it really doesn't help that, apart from these messages already being broken up, it really doesn't help that we're reading them in the in completely random order. Anyway, I think we already have a more detailed recount of the end that was upon them all, just by, <clears throat> just by having read the Olympic history and Olympic war and all that crap. So I don't think it really matters. But... Before we really worry about any of that, we'll just make sure we actually get back to our ship in time. Because that would be lovely. Other, unlike uh, Defense Station Vesper, this place actually has some... <laughs> actually has some length to it. Some rooms that we'll have to traverse, huh? Saying that, we are almost at the exit already, so maybe not. <laughs> maybe I'm completely overestimating shit. I was thinking there, maybe I should have gone through the maze. Maybe that would have been quicker, but no, definitely not. I think this way was definitely quicker. Slash ignore. Doo -doo. And that would be that, with less than half the time used, we are back at our ship! Alright, one more, that should be... The next episode, then, just getting getting the last crystal on Alanos, and then activating the portal, and then kicking Gurria's ass. Us. Maybe. Who knows? Anyway, that should be that, so that was it anyway for today, no matter what happens next time. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button. If you'd like to see more of my random shenanigans, then do hit that subscribe button. And, uh, yeah. I hope to see you all again next time. Uh, later.
just kind of. <laughs>